Why did I do a lexicon of unsustainability this week? That's right, lexicon of unsustainability. It's because I came across a news headline, Potent New Weed Killer Sparks Worries for Children. So this week's theme for lexicon of sustainability is true cost accounting. So it's a new version of uh, pesticide, herbicide. Um, which the company wants to use with corn and soybeans. Hundreds of thousands of children across the country will be at risk of increased exposure to the harmful chemical compound 2,4-D. Also in that mix is glyphosate. 2,4-D was the main ingredient in Agent Orange, which was used in the Vietnam War. 18,000 schools are situated within a thousand feet of a corn corn or soybean field and 5,609 are much closer. I went to eight schools. Just to pinpoint a couple of little schools here, you drive down one uh, driveway to get to the school and you drive right along a uh, cornfield and uh, it's got a fence around it but here it is. It's not even 200 feet. It's like 10 feet. So 25 feet. And that's the 10 Mile Creek Elementary School. Nobody knows if these fields were organic or if they're actually being sprayed with this material. Health risks include thyroid, immune system, reproductive problems, non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, Parkinson's disease. This is new research, by the way. Autism risk higher near pesticide-treated fields, study says. So it's a wake-up call for parents and um, school administrators and teachers to uh, wake up to this. Uh, find out if your fields um, right next to your school are being uh, treated or not and fight this thing altogether because whether it's near a school or near a waterway, there's fish that are running through streams on most of these, near most of these fields. So true cost accounting the word means. What's the external cost of the things we make? We don't take into account that to make this corn there's an external cost around making this corn. And they're using pesticides and herbicides around schools. The cost is going to be the health of our children and our children's children. Whether it's close to schools, or close to businesses, or close to homes, we have a problem here when we're going to continue to use pesticides and herbicides in the 21st century. Come on, people. Wake up. We could be doing a whole lot better than that.